I actually heard about Startup Weekend on Twitter. I've heard it from my classmate, Arlene. I heard it while reading through some blogs. We actually heard about it through IGDA. Um, I'm a member of IGDA and um, they were, I think they put it on their Facebook page and I was like, oh, that's kind of interesting. So I decided to join. The thing that's really good about it is that these startup events create an environment where people can activate those ideas. We and my team got very nervous for it is our first time to have in, to enter this industry and we're just a student, you know. Uh, being in Manila, being in the Philippines, it's a third world country. We have to admit it's a poor country. Although there is progress, people have good ideas, but then it's like they're in a rabbit hole. They, they're not aware that there are other people who can help them out. They don't know that there's a bigger world around them. Startup Weekend provides that environment, that platform for them to launch from. And that's something really, really helpful. People pretty much came to us and uh, they were interested in our idea from the pitch. And, um, and they were asking if they, we needed them, their services. And of course, you know, everything was wonderful. <laughs> and it was just a great opportunity to meet people. Even if we didn't end up teaming with everyone we talked to, it was still a really good opportunity to network and meet other people who are, you know, in the industry, in different fields. <laughs> Here on the laptop, using the laptop is Russell Pashon. He's one of my co-developer in developing the SciTag or the Cypertext generator. Mar Marivik Lavides. She is the one who is researching and the marketer, Angel, she's the one giving inspiration to finish the project and over there is John Ray who gives the design more user-friendly. It's a very nice atmosphere, yeah. very friendly. I met all sorts of people. Um, actually, a lot of them are familiar faces. Crazy people here. Uh, very open, uh, they love to mingle, they love to help. They're all really skilled and really talented and really professional. So it just blows my mind that um, that's, that, that's, that's happening in this country. Here you have marketing people thrown into the mix. You've got programmers, um, designers, business people, and you know, like marketing people. And I just find it interesting when you add that last category of people because you would never see marketing people in Game Jam. And that's, the, that's a new type of person that I met here. I mean, we did find a great marketer to join our group. And um, I'm really grateful for his help with the business plan because that's, I mean, you don't see a lot of programmers or artists who know much about that. So we really were grateful for the opportunity to meet somebody who, whose entire job that was. I, I was able to build quite a, a lot of friends here, uh, quite a number of contacts, uh, which is very valuable. The biggest thing I'll take away from, from this weekend would be the people I've met, the contacts, and the second would be the advice I got from the mentors. It, they just continue to surprise me all the time with the things that they, they're able to think of. I can, I can think of an idea and drive straight at it, but they'll, uh, but they'll always give me something new. To, they'll give me a new direction, a new, new focus. Mm. So last Friday I gave a pitch. Uh, I found the experience really, really thrilling. It was really nerve-wracking, uh, but it's a really good experience. Um, one thing that I'm really, really happy to see in this country is that I noticed some of the people who are pitching, they're not really public speakers but they believe in their idea so much that they'd step up in front of the crowd and grab the mic and say, hey, this is my idea. I need this and this and this. And then here we are, um, day three of Startup Malila and, everybody, and everybody's gonna be about to give their presentations already.
So what you do is you swipe your phone. Collections of the movies you watch throughout your entire life. MC Technology North Hills. And of course our very own KO1. So revenues will be mainly acquired through brokerage. So now the question is, where is the money in here? So how do we get money? I'm going to make this quick. We get money and a lot of it by introducing the new method, the group selling of tickets, which is very hip for Filipinos. Very, we're so impressed by you that we would like to invite you to come to Singapore.